My goodness, just those few notes of that music just sends chills down my spine, and I'm probably not the only one. Welcome back to AM Kentucky. It's the 45th anniversary of the Halloween movie franchise, which has many ties to Bowling Green and throughout the series. Now, this morning, we have celebrity guest Tyler Maine, who was Michael Myers in the Rob Zombie's Halloween movies, Sabretooth and X-Men, Ajax and Troy, and a former pro wrestler. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, thanks for having me. We're so excited to have you. You know, you are in town for such an exciting time, and, and you're going to be at Skeleton's Lair. Let's just talk that about that correct. real quick. Yes. Yeah, tonight yeah. and tomorrow night, signing autographs and... Yes, um, and meeting everybody, so come on out and say hi, and let's have a great time. Yeah, well, let's talk about your, your career here for a minute. Um, playing Michael Myers, this guy is super tall. Um, <laughs> and, you know, Michael Myers is tall, such an imposing figure. Yes. Well, well I'm definitely the tallest Michael Myers. Is that right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, what kind of research goes into playing this character? Well, you know, I knew that it was such a big franchise, and I wanted to do it justice. So I watched all the other Halloweens, and I figured out how I would bring my own take on and with Rob Zombies, we showed the backstory of how he's a product of his environment. So mm -hmm. I just wanted to develop the character and, and just give him that little extra um, from the asylum to actually what you saw getting the mask and for the very first time and becoming Michael Myers. Oh my gosh, so. that, that role, it's, it's amazing. Um, did you expect this kind of response from fans worldwide? You know, I had no idea. I knew that they'd done several renditions of it, but I had no idea the fan following that Halloween has. You know, we just did the 45th, and uh, it was amazing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so tell me about your other roles, too. We just talked about Sabretooth and Ajax. Um, yeah, I've, I, you know, I've been very lucky. I've had a very uh, lucrative career playing several different uh, characters, and it's just been a blast being a... Uh, uh, growing up in Canada, being a uh, small town kid to make it here is amazing. Yes, yeah, so dream come you, true. When did you know this is what I want to do for a living? I want to be an actor. I knew when I was a little kid. I was a tall, skinny kid, glasses, braces, slightly <laughs> dyslexic. So um, growing up, I'd watch pro wrestling, mm -hmm. and I was like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a pro wrestler. And then I'd watch action movies, and then I'd go into uh, other movies. And, and I go, I'm going to do that someday. And um, you just got to follow your dreams and, and do what you want to do. Yeah, you know? that's some great advice right there. Very lucky, yeah. Yeah, so did, did wrestling help out a lot in these action roles? Most definitely. <laughs> Most definitely. <laughs> Um, well, your appearances keep you pretty busy. Are you on the road quite a bit when you're not working? Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm going to conventions meeting fans because I have my own production company also, that yeah. uh, main entertainment. And we've got a uh, graphic novel that we're doing now that is out on Kickstarter. Yes, so, we have yes. some pictures right here of that. Oops, let me get those. Tell me a little bit about this. Yeah, it, it is a, based on a book by my friend John Saunders. But imagine Sons of Anarchy meets the Punisher with a human trafficking theme. Mm -hmm. So I've been teaming with human trafficking awareness organization DeliverFund.org to help put an end to human trafficking. And in the Kickstarter, we also have a tier as coffee and comics tier where you can get 12 ounces of their coffee mm -hmm. plus the graphic novel and help put an end to human trafficking and have a great read. Yeah, and what a great message, you know, uh, just a great subject to get behind. Um, to bring attention to because there's so much of that going on right now. It's happening it's, everywhere. It's so sad and yes. so good for you bringing attention to it in this Thank way. You. Thank you. Yeah. So this weekend at Skeleton's Lair, um, yes. are you so excited? I am. I am. <laughs> well, you know, being John Carpenter's hometown, it's, right. it's the place to be. <laughs> Um, well, you are going to be there tonight. What time will you be there? Uh, I will be there tonight, I believe, around 6.30. Okay. And tomorrow night I'll probably be a little earlier. So, oh, all right. And I'll be there till the end, so come on by and uh, 
let's uh, have some fun, have some Yes, scares. I'm so glad that you're not scary. <laughs> <laughs> Will you have the mask on? Uh, no. You're just gonna no. be yourself, I'm Tyler be Mains. Myself. Okay, well, meet <laughs> actor Tyler Main tonight and tomorrow at Skeleton's Lair Screen Park. To purchase tickets, you have to purchase tickets to get into the Screen Park, and then you can meet Tyler Mains. Autographs are 30, selfies are 20, the combo, 40 bucks. For tickets and information to meet Michael Myers, actor Tyler Main, log on to SkeletonsLayer.com. We'll be right back.